suggests that many parents, especially moms, are making tough decisions when it comes to working and staying home with kids. Yeah, it's really a hard balancing act. Well, could the pandemic push moms out of the workforce? CBS 46's Yasmina Alston sat in on a conversation about some challenges parents are facing. During this pandemic, many parents, especially moms, have been working and helping their kids with schoolwork at home. It's a lot to do and has many parents talking. I can't work my regular hours. I have to be at home with my two young children. She has a kindergartner and a first grader. What can we do about my hours? It's a new type of conversation since the start of the pandemic, trying to juggle working and being at home with children for virtual learning. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, Coffee with Kathy. In today's video, I'm gonna be sharing with you a day in the life of a working mom while I am homeschooling both of the girls. So I have Lily here with me. Um, Emma is actually already in her room getting started on homeschooling. Um, and I will kind of explain that here in a minute. But let us pray. Father God, I am a child of God. What I am not is a homeschool teacher. God, I'm at home, but Lord, ain't no teaching going on around here. Hi, I'm Erica Otero Vargas, owner and artisan of Black Girl Art Lady Ella Studios in Boston, Massachusetts. Why did you create your business? I've been crocheting from a very early age, and uh, my grandmother taught me and instilled in me that uh, all babies deserve to have handmade uh, items when they're born, and um, they become kind of like your family heirloom, so I decided to um, take that passion and talent and uh, share it into um, other items uh, besides just baby items and uh, share it with uh, the rest of uh, the world. How do you juggle your business, your regular job, and your household? It's quite a juggling act. Um, it was a little bit more manageable when we had COVID, interestingly enough. Um, just having that time and that separation of being able to be away from the home, away from your kids, and kind of having those separate times uh, to do you know, all the activities for each perspective um, thing. Uh, like I would crochet on the train on the way to work. Um, so that would give me some time to do that. But now with COVID, it's, it's much more difficult. What has been the hardest part of your life with the pandemic going on? Uh, homeschooling has been one of the bit, one, one of the hardest, uh, but uh, I think that I can speak uh, for every parent uh, in America. Um, I think uh, outside of that, it's just kind of creating the separation of, you know, business, home, um, and, and children so I can continue to create, which has, you know, it gets challenging. Um, I try my best to make sure that I get a little bit of time in the morning, uh, whether that be to have my coffee or kind of think about what projects I want to do or what I have in progress. Um, so it's, it's ongoing. It's an ongoing challenge. What advice would you give working moms? Uh, be kind to yourself. Your kids are only young once. Um, this too shall pass and, you know, just kind of indulge in, in, in your children and, you know, home is the, the first, uh, pinnacle of health. You know, you got to take care of your family first and foremost, um, take it day by day and, uh, create your, your support network, lean on your support systems. It's very important. 